Hey, what is going on everybody? Scott Gaming here, thank you very much for joining us. As you can see, we're back. We're playing some more. Wasteland 3. I think we're heading the right way. Hmm. This um. is Steel Town's job placement area, where Assistant Bianchi oversees the testing of new Steel Town employees to find their best fit. Okay, but we don't want to go there, right? I think we want to go here. Is that right? Is that right? Are we supposed to be going this way? I can't remember what we were doing. We got we got some points to spend. Um, how about some speed? There you go. A little bit of speed for you. What else have we got? I think we'll hold on to that. And then... I think we'll hold on to that as well. Anyone else who's who's ready to... Spend some points? I don't think so. <laughs> what were we doing? <laughs> um, downtown Showdown. Angelia for the Patriarch. We don't want to do that. Um, we've been asked to investigate the cause of the, of the production slowdown. Get Steel Town back on track. Are we meant to be going down the, down the hill? Let's go back this way for a second. There's a big question mark here, so let's come back this way. Whoopsie. I thought... I, I think we're going back. No. Uh, we don't have anything to report. Oh, hold on. What did that say? I mean, it, yeah, okay, good. Let's go this way, everybody. Whoopsie. Oh, look, there's a person over here. It appears the medical supply merchant. The machine offers a surprisingly useful array of goods. Go shopping. What we got? Do we need any bullets? We did stock up on some. How are we doing over here? Let's buy some... Buy some more of these. Uh, what we got over here? Some... Some cricket bars. We'll buy some of those, I guess. Okay, good. Hello. Administrator Markham has informed me that <coughs> Steel Town's medical services and supplies are now available to you. Oh, jeez. You're the nurse and you're sick? Why don't you take some of your medicine? Take shrinkage out of my commission. I, I need that money. I mean, this doesn't sound ideal. Uh, can we ask you some questions? I don't give free medical advice, but anything else, okay, I guess. Uh, so you make drugs? <sighs> some, yeah. We have a medical supply unit. Makes drugs, hospital equipment, first aid kits. Only a small part of what Steel Town does, though. Mostly heavy equipment, weapons. Okay. So, the tools to hurt you, and the tools to heal you. We get you coming and going. Um, what do you know about what's going on in the factory? Oh, the noise is doing nothing. My headache. That's what I know. <sighs> I guess some of the workers think they're being treated unfairly. And they're on strike. They should try working on commission. Then they'd know real pain. I just hope they sort it out soon. Markham says the gangs are getting closer every day. And if the workers don't start making guns soon... We're doomed. Okay. Thanks for the information. Yeah, sure. My pleasure. Okay. Get better thing. Thanks. No problem. Patched up. Just waiting for paperwork to clean. Jesus God. Ludlow's guard bots are throwing the poor workers like rag dolls. I. Uh, who are you? What? 
What do you want? Uh, how did they get hurt? All that noise you're hearing. There's a strike going on in the factory below us. Celine Crow, the leader of the workers, is fighting for better conditions. Carl Ludlow, Steel Town's security chief, is. Well, you can see what he's done here. He's been trying to use his guard bots to beat and zap Crow and her workers into submission. And this is the result broken bodies and bleeding heads. But the workers are tough, and Crow's determined. She's not given up. I volunteered to drag people out of the elevator and help patch them up. It seems like I'm doing all of it now. I told you I can't help, Robin. I have a... Let's go! Cold. I'd infect everyone. Uh-huh. Anyway, while Crow and Ludlow fight it out down there, we... I try to patch up the casualties and get them to rest. But the idiots just keep going back down to fight again. He said Lolo's bots are zapping workers. They're using disruptors on them, like the ones you're carrying. Those things will give anybody a jolt. But all Steel Town factory workers are fitted with cybernetic implants that allow them to operate the heavy lifting exos and so on. Okay. If an implanted worker gets hit enough with a disruptor weapon, it fucks with their cybernetics and takes them out of the fight permanently. Or at least until management resets them. And man, it hurts like hell. Like you were setting them on fire. Nobody's dying down there. Only? <laughs> but no. People are dying. Getting thrown across a room by a robot is not non-lethal. And apparently, Ludlow's got himself a sniper rifle. And he hasn't been shy about using it. Okay. Of course, the workers haven't been exactly gentle either. I mean, they've been smashing the machines and wrecking finished goods. But since all their opponents are bought, there haven't been any casualties on the management side. Yet, that could change if they made it up here. Um, any opinion on who's right uh, on this? They're both wrong. I mean, Ludlow's wronger, for sure. <laughs> He's a corrupt, lazy bastard who milks the workers for everything he can get. Okay. But Crow knew full well the gangs were heading our way and she still decided to strike. And that's putting us all in danger. Just plain selfish as far as I can see. Uh, who are you? I'm Nurse Ferenzi's assistant, Raman. I'm usually a nut tightener, but the computation engine reassigned me. So here I am. Uh, we'll let you get back to yes, patching people up. Please. All right. Who's next? Okay, kid. Oh, hold on. Oh, apparently non-lethal means they only ninety-nine and nine tenths kill them. Okay, here we go travel to the factory level i don't feel like i have all the information i i have no idea who's right and who's wrong uh, but i guess we'll make that decision as we head down there right okay what have we got going on down here it looks pretty quiet oh open the door and nobody gets hurt fuck you lovo you keep saying that and then you keep killing my people now get markham down here so i can give her our demands no more 16 hour shifts no more docking our pay for missing quotas that nobody could make no more locking us in the factory so we can't see our families and most importantly lovo no more you I'm not bothering the boss with your crybaby bullshit. We'll settle this between us. Then good luck getting through the door, asshole. Because it's not opening for anybody but... Ah, oh, fuck this. Oh, Jesus. Hey, 
Hey, who are you? What the hell? You the help Markham's been promising me. A damn time. I don't know if we're here to help you. Rose hiding with her crew in the foundry behind that blast door. Get it open. We can end this bullshit. Who are you? Carl Ludlow. Markham's chief of security. I'm getting closer to quitting every day. This job is bullshit. No support from management. No respect from the workers. I gotta do it all myself. I get the feeling if you left, it would solve a lot of the problems. But I'm not going anywhere until Crow ends her stupid strike. And these fools get back to work making war bots like they're supposed to. They fucking know the gangs are coming, and they still won't pick up their tools. Assholes. Um, who's Crow? Markham didn't tell you? Christ. Am I the only one who gives a damn around here? Okay. Okay, I'll lay it out for you. Crow's a thug. She claims she's fighting for workers' rights. But what she really wants is to kill us all and run the place herself. Either that or let the gangs kill us. She's fucking crazy, that's all. Now, what was that about gangs coming? Since Liberty's army fell apart, the Piasos and Codfishers and Scar Collectors have gone back to old-fashioned raiding. We're right in their path. Ain't a matter of if they're coming, it's when. I wonder what would have happened... Away. I wonder what would have happened if I hadn't have killed uh, or, or re arrested Liberty. The Marshals can't spare anybody to protect us, so we gotta protect ourselves. Using the warbots and turrets and guns we're famous for. Problem is, these crows are on strike. We're not making them. We're gonna get slaughtered. Okay. Like, what's crows doing that's so bad? Well, she's tried to kill me a few times, that's for sure. Beyond that, she's refused to work. Smashed up the machines, destroyed finished goods, and incited all the other workers to do the same. And all at the worst possible time. Steel Town is going to get leveled if the workers don't get back to work. Um, so Crow hasn't actually killed anybody. Maybe not here, but there'll be blood in her hands just the same. You better believe it. Without the guns and armor and bots we make, we're all sitting ducks for the warlords and the gangs, and she knows it. The gangs are heading right for us, but does she care? Fuck no. All she cares about are her rights. Selfish bitch. Uh, can we talk to Crow? <laughs> sure. If you want to get your ear chewed off. But I guarantee everything she tells you will be a lie. Nothing short of telling her you killed Markham will get her to open that door. Holocomb's right over there. Oh, wait, I blasted it. Sorry. Guess you're out of luck. You have a plan for getting through the door? What? I thought you were bringing me a plan. I've been asking Markham to find me a way through for days. Figured maybe her super genius computation engine could come up with something. Jesus. A heavy duty cutting laser will do it. There is one in the robot factory. It is too heavy for humans to carry. But it would be easy to build a warbot and mount the laser upon it, then bring it here. Hi, <laughs> that's a great idea. You're a genius. Assemble a warbot? Not in the least. All that was required was an I mean, she makes a valid point. Resources. Yeah, yeah. Okay, then. We got a plan. But it ain't gonna be quite as easy as Dai says. This crow's wreckers are all through the plant, tearing shit up. You have to clear them out before you can build the bot. You up for it? Um... Clear out the workers, you mean kill them? Markham's too soft. These scum don't deserve mercy. But I didn't say kill them. You can use Markham's non-lethal methods if you want. Just be aware they're not going to do you the same kindness. And also, every minute we waste here, being nice, means the gangs get another mile closer. So ask yourselves what your priorities are. Save a few lives here. Or save everybody's lives later. I mean, I feel like I can fight off the gangs, right? 
We're here to negotiate an end to the strike. Fine. But trust me. The only way you're going to get Crow to the table is to get through that door and stick a gun in her face. And for that, you're going to need the laser bot. Only because you shot the bloody thing. Okay. Great. All you got to do is go to each of the stations in the Warbot assembly line, push the buttons to build the bot, and put the laser on it. Then it'll show up back here. Crow's thugs may make a move before that happens. So I'll stay behind to keep this room secure. I'll be here when you get back with the laser. Uh huh. Or you can just stand around here with your thumbs up your ass. I want to shoot him so bad. What a vile man. Well said. Zeppi, well said. You're not wrong. Um, I guess we go up here, right? And have a little look around. Another vending machine. How many saw blades have we got, actually? 101. We should be fine. Um, I think we're good. Do we need any more of these? Let's buy a few more. They're pretty cheap, right? We'll take the drug stash. Look at this place. Welcome to the Warbot Factory Operational Status Board Computer. Please indicate parameters that are required. Check worker productivity status. Workers present idle, workers present negatively productive. Oh dear. Returning to menu. Warbot completion status. 0% complete. Okay. Quota of compliance. Incomplete, 100%. Okay, not great. Okay, I feel like we've learned a little bit more about the computer. So we heading this way then. Well, you know what we probably need to do before we get started? Um, these, right? I don't think we got enough of these, but. You can keep those. And I guess you'll take that. Oh no, you know what, you take this. Okay, good. We're in. We're in the factory. Interference with factory scheduling is ruined. Return to your jobs. Well, our shift with no breaks are a crime. Go fuck yourself, robots. I mean, he's, he's right. Oh, well. You are a stick on company time. Return to your jobs. Why don't you return to Sitting during work hours and blocking access to the warbot assembly line. Violations noted. Come any closer. Stop. Who are you? We're the Rangers. Who are you? We are the workers who shall not be moved. So you better not try anything. Uh, we're here to help. And get this robo dog away from us. We won't talk till it's gone. Uh, we'll see what we can do. Ludlow, can you hear us? I can hear you making fucking fools of yourselves. Oh, I hate him. All this dog to back off. Oh, the poor babies. You tell them I would be sick of dogs on them if they got off their asses and did some fucking work for a change. Or better yet, just kick their asses like I told you to. Use Markham's mercy weapons if it makes you feel better. Or not. So long, Fido. I have to say, I like annoying Ludlow. You, you killed it! I, I can't believe... Uh, that was amazing! Uh, so... Uh, 
what do you want? Uh, we have some questions. Sure. It's not like we're going anywhere. Now, why are you on strike? You got an hour? Seriously, there's so much wrong here. I don't know where to start. First off, Ludlow's a shakedown artist, making us pay for food breaks and piss breaks, medical care. On top of that, our schedule is insane. We've been doing 12 hour shifts with no breaks for weeks now. We haven't even been allowed to go home. People are dying at their machines. Markham seems like a reasonable person, but Ludlow won't let us talk to her. He says he's in charge down here, not her. Uh, so you think Ludlow's the cause of the problems? The whole cause? There's no way he should have been hired as security chief, but he's not just bad at his job. He's an asshole on purpose. Shouting at us, pushing us around, having his robots reprimand us with disruption weapons. And that's on top of milking us for bribes. Making us pay for all things that would be free in a functional workplace. Bathroom breaks, lunch breaks, even beds. We gotta pay him to sleep. How he ended up in this job isn't as important to me as how he leaves it. Which should be feet first in a black bag. Wowza. Um, what do you think of Crow? Crow may be a little crazy, but her heart's in the right place. She wants us workers to have a fair deal. I mean, that doesn't sound wrong, does it? For it. Okay. Rise up against the, the machine, I get that. Why not? Ludlow started it. He's killed plenty of us. Not with a gun, maybe, but with the machines that mangle us. The hours that grind us and the illnesses and injuries that come from that. He didn't listen when we asked politely, so... If violence is the only language he can hear, well, Crow speaks it fluently. Okay. Thanks, you've answered our questions. Now what? Um... We just need you to get out of the way. Sorry. Being in the way is the only leverage we've got. We're not moving. Not even for us? Oh, I wish I'd have got some of these. We're trying to get Crow and Ludlow face to face to hash it out. That's the only way to build a laser to cut through the door. What? No way! You just want to take away the only protection Crow has? We can't agree to that. Uh, then we'll have to arrest you. Without a fight, you won't. God damn it. Well, that's, that's a tad annoying, right? Okay. We'll come back to you. get you involved maybe not just yet this is gonna blow up right for sure come on okay i think that's the best we can I think that's the best we can muster How do I know how much we need to hit them with, I wonder? How is this out of ammo? I haven't fired it yet. Did we fire it at the dog, maybe? I don't know. Okay. I think that's you done. Great. He'll be worried about near being near that battery. 68% fine. Shit, that was a normal gun. How are all these guns out of ammo? God damn it. Oh, we probably could have shot as well. I'm an idiot. Is 
I guess we move you into some cover. And get you to reload your gun again. Do we run in and start punching? Or do we run over and hide? I genuinely don't know. I think we're going to run over and hide as it goes. Uh oh. Well, this is awkward. Firing hot tar at us. Jeez. Okay. There is a lot of them. I need to get you moved as well, right? sure these are the guns for us, you know. They're not really what I, were, I was hoping for. Whoopsie. I think I used the wrong gun again. Brace yourself, mate. Okay, I'm a little bit worried about you, not going to lie. Here we go. Fordite is our man here, I think. Get you to go down with these disrupt disruption fields. I don't know the meaning of fear. What's it like? Okay, that's good news. Maybe we just have to get them to ten. I don't know. Now right, you're done get you in any more cover I don't think we can so this could be bad Here's the holy yes. shit Let's slow you down. oh jeez enough of the hot tar Oh my god. Holy crap.
I don't know if we're in or out of the circle. I'm a little bit worried about it. I think we get you moved first of all, right? Let's see if it is just get them to 10, I think. Although maybe with you we throw out some of these, right? You need to come over here and start punching? Maybe. So you're up to seven. Gomez, can we... We could throw one of these out. I'm not sure this is wise, but we could throw one of these out. Let's do it. I feel about that. Hmm? We haven't got many of these grenades. Okay. Kill you. Kill you all. Well, Verge. You can't go anywhere. So we're on to you. Dude's on eight. Can we get him down? Oh, come on. Didn't need to do that. Okay, I'm still a little bit worried about you. Let's move back one so we're 100% sure. And then we'll... I guess hit you. Nice. And then we'll run over here. Good luck, Gomez. Don't you don't you be hitting her? Oh, come on. Oh god. Gomez, hang in there. It's better than nothing. Right, cool, I, I think you're up with some punching first. Don't miss, Cordite. Do not miss. Nice. I think we move you here. I don't think we're going to be able to do enough to him, but... Verge, do you want to have a little pop? Nice. 
Oh, how can we run away? It's really annoying. Okay, we don't mind that. Just gotta watch out for these tar guns. Okay, we look like we're okay. Oh, I spoke too soon. This is an interesting concept. I, I don't know if I like it. Just having to shoot them like 10 times. How are you not down? So I think that gets rid of the circle, which is good. We should get you to heal, I think. Ready to continue. Okay, I think we leave you down for one moment and we toss some more bullets this way. reload again. And cord I guess we run you over here or do we run you over this way? Probably over this way, right? About to kill one, I think. Sorry about that. I mean, it wasn't intentional, I will say that. I don't know if I could help that, really. Alright, let's give you some of this. Uh, we want you to use one of these things. Have we got anyone else who's got anything like that? I don't think so. Okay, let's come back to you. Oh, that's not what we meant to do. Yeah, it's an interesting concept, though. You have to hit them ten times to to bring down their resilience. Oh, we could we could have eaten a cricket bar, right? Yeah, have some toast. Okay, nice. Yeah, Cordite was invaluable in that fight. Let's uh, let's loot. Is there anything in here? Yes, there is. Luis, baby, it's Florinda. Listen, I just want to let you know, if anybody tells you I pulled an Utter McKinley, it's not true. I just got sick of this place and decided to take an early retirement. With benefits. Gotta lay low for a bit. But I'll be back soon. And then we'll finally be able to get out of that damn camp. Love you, baby. Hmm. Stay safe.
Okay, let's just head this way. We've used all of our grenades already. That's not ideal. assembly or uh, assemble yeah let's do it here they go they're off we did the first section nice we've made some progress Do you think our weapons where we just shoot and they do like damage to to robots and stuff? Do you think they do disruption? I'm guessing not. Wait, who are these snow decks? Lolo, these fuckers have lethal weapons. <laughs> you and your slackers had your chance to surrender when it was just the guard bots, crow. Now things are getting real. Technically we didn't have lethal weapons, we had a bear. That's not my fault. Talk to Reg. Just doing what he told us to. Who's Reg? I don't know. Workers are damaging Steel Town property. That cannot be allowed. Use the non-lethal weapons so you don't damage Steel Town property. Just die. It's not what we're here for, right? We're just here to sort of speak to Reg. Oh, Jesus. Looks like Markham's hired some human muscle. Who the fuck are you, assholes? Uh, we Desert Rangers. What's going on here? Calm down, we're here to help grow. Sure you are. You wouldn't be down here unless Markham sent you. Come on, crew. Let's wreck these goons. Um I mean, we've got it, let's give it a go. Shit, Reg. I think they mean it. Yeah, Reg. I'll take a zap or two for the cause. I want to see my family again. I'm out. Okay, well that's Slightly better than nothing, right? Weekend warriors. Where's your devotion to the cause? Where's your devotion to Crow? All right, you thugs. Guess I'll just fight you myself. I'll send you back to Markham in pieces. Okay, I don't feel like Reg is helping the situation here. I think we switch up guns here. A little bit worried about some of these barrels. These guys are here as well. Um, let's give it let's give it a go with shooting with one of these and see what happens. Okay, you res resisted our disruption field. That is not ideal. Let's see if you resist. From systems. Yeah, you didn't resist any of that, which is good. A little bit worried about these barrels still. We're right next to one over here. Okay, we'll come back to you, Cordite. Where can we go stand where we don't get exploded? I don't know. Genuinely don't know. Maybe we shoot and then we uh, 
We back up. Shit. Probably should have seen that coming, right? We haven't got great shots on these guys. I don't know if this makes any difference, right? we got here arms reduce damage body this is target armor inflict shock okay slow nice that's that's not bad do we just march verge in there that's i mean that's what he's here for right that's awkward Yeah, we did hit him with a disruption field, finally. I mean, he didn't really do much, but, you know. Okay, I was hoping for some, some more disruption there. I guess we just get you to run around the corner and start punching, right? Again, we'll put you in trouble every time. What's happening here? Why can't I... Okay, you're in a bit of a weird... Bit of a weird place in the... In the square... Who's this dude? Let's slow you down. Completely ignored him. Hang in there, Cordai. Bloody hot tar. Oh god. Locked on, watch out. The giant power loader has called out one of the, your squad's members. We'll charge the target with a single minded focus until one of them is dead or the status effect expires. Keep your rangers out of its reach or find another way to immobilize it. Okay. Well, I guess the plus point is it's going for Cordite. Let's get you moved over here. Okay, that's better than nothing. Um, that was the wrong gun. Sorry about that, Pizepi. That was that was my bad. Okay, we need to get you out of the way somewhat. Okay, you still got some more shots. Nice. I'm coming back to you because I need to get you out of the way, I think. Um... How did you miss? Nice. Alright, what do we do with you? 
This person's only got... Th no, no. Hold on. You've got six and you run over there. You've got four and you're over here. Do we just try and run away? I think we probably do, right? We got a long way away and see what he does. Okay. Yeah, it's good, that. Don't punch me. Oh, come on again. Okay, here we go. Now we're talking. Have some more grenades still. Question is, do we shoot or do we? I think I can run past him. Hold on, a, hold on a second. Right, you've got free AP. I think I can get you to do this. I'd love to run over here, punch him a couple of times, and then run a little bit further, but let's give it a go. And you can still run away, which is nice. Okay, that's good. Like that. You will get you to throw out one of these. And then we're back with you. And I guess we just... Take a couple of steps away and then... Okay, not as good as we, as we hoped for. Here goes nothing. Here comes the hot tar again. Stop hitting... Stop hitting Bobby with it. Stop, stop hitting everyone with it. Okay. Up to four. seven. Up to eight. Six percent? That's not ideal. Okay, you can't do anything, so let's get you standing over here. Zeppi, you can't do anything either. Cordai, I guess we run you over here and get you to punch, right? Here he comes. Uh. 
I saw that way just a bunch once. I love it. Okay, good. Holy crap. Okay, there, there they go again. Nice. Here we go again. At this rate, I'm disappointed I didn't go with more people with, uh, with melee. Yeah, the biggest problem is the bear. The bear is kicking everyone's ass. Okay, we need to heal up again. And then we'll probably call it here, I guess. This is interesting. I am... Um, I'm genuinely not sure... Well, I, you know, I mean, obviously we know... We know that there's this disagreement in... In the working conditions, which I absolutely understand. Um... You know, it's been uh, it's been an interesting one. Let's uh, head over here to this computer. Um, yes, let's build the next thing. What we got? I feel like the building of a warbot probably doesn't need people. Yep, I, th I think we figured that. Okay, we're going to wrap up here. Um, is there anything we've missed in this room? Oh yeah, there's something over here. I'm sure we could have made more use of some of these uh, explosive barrels and stuff. But again, it's that fine line between... Uh, That's Hamagotchi. Fine line between the uh, the um, the non-lethal versus the lethal. It's it's a difficult one to to, to play because I think we could have finished these people off a lot quicker if we wanted to. But what the hell are they doing, Ludlow? Are they building a war bot? <laughs> You'll see. You'll oh look. See. Another one. Okay. A lot of energy batteries and stuff over here. Okay. So can we just sneak past everybody and get to... There's a lot of them. Okay, we're going to wrap up here. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe button, follow us on Twitter at Scott Gaming. We'll see you again soon. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen. You have been watching Scott Dog Gaming. Don't forget to follow on Twitch and Twitter and head over to YouTube for daily content. See you again soon.